What's up, fam? It's your big bro, Joy. Welcome back to the channel. Much love and light to everybody out there. Uh, thank y'all for joining me today. It's another quick reading. I figured uh, while I was down here waiting for my food to finish uh, cooking, well, warming up, I was going to just jump on here right quick before like a little quick little 10 minute thing. But that's when, it, when it's done. So I say, let me go ahead and get a, get another uh, reading in right quick for y'all. Let's see what you guys need to know right now. Wow. Wow. Yo, <clears throat> things are about to start changing for y'all if you didn't realize it. But we're vibing towards a wish fulfillment that's coming through for somebody here. We got wishes. It says you will experience a wish fulfillment. Dreams really do come true. So expect something that you've been wishing for. Some that you've been hoping for. And I'm getting for some of y'all some that you've been focusing on. So you need to be very, very careful what it is that you're focusing on right now. Because you guys, your manifestation abilities are high right now. Whether you uh, realize that or not, or not you're, man you're manifesting right now. You're in manifestation mode. Or I'm hearing amplified. That energy is being amplified right now. So you need to be very, very mindful about what it is that you're focusing on and what you're giving your attention and your energy to. Okay, we have new ideas. Some new idea may come to you that may be beneficial beneficial to you in some sort of way. We got a new idea come to you that will change your world. A game changer. Something, some idea you're going to have is about the potentially bring in some money, some much needed money or offer you a, a, another uh, source of income, another avenue, another stream of income is what uh, I meant to say. But money is coming to you guys soon. OK, this could be money coming to you that is going to help you implement this idea or actually bring this idea to fruition. OK, or this idea me in turn. Uh, be a money making idea for you. Okay. We're also vibing the energy is coming up again. You're vibing towards luck and love. So you guys may be meeting someone special, someone new amongst the crowd. Okay. This could be new friends. Uh, this could be a new love, uh, love connection. Okay. Um, it may be just somebody who just, you can just go out. Um, why do I, why am I hearing an activity partner for somebody? Some of y'all might just, y'all might not want to date. Y'all may just want somebody that could go out with you. What well, ain't that dating? I don't know. Mom, I just heard activity partner for somebody. I don't know. What am I quote? I don't know. Somebody's maybe wanting an activity partner or somebody just to do things with, right? With no strings attached to just um, ooh, maybe somebody might be friends with Bennett, friends with benefits. I don't know. Or but this is uh I'm getting more so somebody to, to go out with, somebody to go hiking with for somebody, go to the movies with, go shopping with, to just do things with, right? So they make you more so you can be more active. But I see more social times happening for you because more people are trying to come into your life, right? That message came up in another reading as well. You will receive invitations to interact with others socially, online or offline. So either way, more people are wanting to get to know you. More people are wanting to come into your life, you know, and, you know, and get to know you better, okay? Um, we have divination. The information you seek will be found in a reading. Seek and you shall find. So if you guys are having any doubts, um, any uh, about what's taking place right now, get you a reading. You know what I'm saying? You might need to go to somebody. If you don't have your own cards, you don't do your own readings. Go to somebody you trust and get a reading done on yourself, you know, to check the overall energy that's around you. Or like pull your own cards, you feel me? Get your own Oracle deck. Pull your own cards. You can even make your own Oracle deck with some with some uh, paper. You know what I'm saying? Like this. Like how I make somebody out there also, this this came up for a reason. Somebody needs to make your own Oracle decks, you know, to help you uh, sift out the energy, right? See, I, I cut, uh, got some black uh, paper, cut them up, and make your own decks. Put your own stuff together. Got some white uh, card stock, heavier card stock, right? Because we don't want nothing real flimsy, little just paper, but card stock. Cut them up in the, the rectangles or squares, whatever shape you want to do it. And start making your own oracle decks, you know what I'm saying, to, to help you just channel. Because what, that's what I do, I channel decks, you know what I'm saying? When I do decks, when I create decks, I, it's all channeled, okay? I don't like 
I say, okay, I want this kind of theme, and then I just start channeling, and stuff just start coming to me. That's why I said some some new ideas. Some somebody out here, you may be able to make this uh, money making oracle deck or, or, or tarot deck, or something like that, right? But something somebody's about to have some sort of money making idea, a new idea. Uh, you're gonna have some sort of epiphany that's happening to your life, and it also says the signs, baby. Pay attention to the signs. Okay, it says pay attention to the signs around you now. Spirit is trying to get your attention on some matter. Okay, let's see what what do we need to pay attention to also? What do we need to pay attention to from the same deck, which is uh, the fortune teller deck? Link is in the description box. Okay, you guys, just to let you guys know again that all my personal decks, the link is in the description box. All you got to do is click on the description box. Okay. And it's, the link is going to be right in there. It's going to take you to the store. All right. You're going to have some sort of success and it's going to make people jealous. OK, some success you're vibing towards is going to make people jealous. Some achievement you will some achievement will bring jealousy and envy from others. Enjoy your life, period. You feel me? Don't don't get caught up and don't get hung up on how somebody else is feeling about you, what they saying about you behind your back because they just hating. They're just hating. If you know you, you know, if you're successful, something's going right for you, and you got some mofo on the side who's just talking crap. They jealous. They hating. Period. You feel me? It's the start. The start. There's a brand new start here for you. The beginning of a new cycle approaches. Get ready. Spirit wants you to get ready right now because things are getting ready to pop off for you guys. Things are gonna be more exciting for you guys as well. We got whole new, which is a uh, Hawaiian. Uh, sea turtle, okay? A situation requires more patience than you would like. Find comfort and peace in waiting, right? Don't rush things. Don't rush this new cycle. Let I'm hearing go with the flow, okay? Some people are going to be in, uh, leaving your life. Some people will be entering your life. Either way, go with the flow. There's money coming soon. Pace yourself with it. Don't spend it all at one place. Don't spend it all at one time. There's love. If you're open for love, that's coming uh, through too. Make sure that you vet these people, okay? Because some people that might show up might not be for you, you feel me? But some, somebody's going to show up that is for you, okay? Uh, you may find yourself leaning on uh, divination tools also, too. If you're, fi if you're finding yourself confused, you don't know what to do, you don't know whose offer to accept, you don't know you know what path to go down, you can just consult, um, consult the oracle, you know what I'm saying? Consult the oracle and get your message, get your vibes, you feel me? And just go from there with that, okay? Let's go ahead and pull a spirit team message and I'll wrap this up. Yeah, spirit said, you too blessed to be stressed, period. You know what I'm saying? You too blessed to be stressed. Don't let nobody stress you out. Especially when you start, when you start, um, <clears throat> when you start getting your blessings, when things start popping off for you. And when I say things start popping off for you, that's when other people are going to be able to see it. Other people are going to be able to witness or they, they they will be witnessing. It's not like you posting it all on social media or just bragging about it. No, this is like this is going to be inevitable. They're going to be able they're going to find out about stuff, find out about success or see how you move or they may mistakenly see something online or something like that. I don't know. Either way, just know that you're too blessed to be stressed and don't let somebody try to rain on your parade. OK. Because you know how that happens. You start bossing up. You start leveling, leveling up. You start uh, being abundant, being successful, having some sort of wish fulfillment. Things are finally going in your way. And you got some hater from the sideline, you know, trying to hate on you. Like, who cares? Go ahead and continue hating. Let them hate. You feel me? Let them do what they're doing. And you just live your best life. You enjoy these blessings. You enjoy uh, the fruits of your labor because you've worked hard. You've gone through so, so many trials and tribulations that you deserve these blessings that are getting ready to pop off in your life. So just enjoy it. Don't let nobody take that from you. Don't let nobody take your blessings from you in this good time that you have in front of you right now. Okay. So if you guys have enjoyed this message, please like, hit that like button. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you want to be a part of the fam. Okay. And if this resonated, um, yeah, comment down below and let me know how you feel about it, okay? Y'all take care. Much love and light to y'all. Be safe. Ciao.